Well, good afternoon, guys. Trevor Thompson, TNT Pressure Cleaning, Dynamite Service with explosive results. You guys can see that the X-Jet Jet Poly Tank has been stored. That's a 55-gallon vertical poly tank. Uh, so you can put caustic chemicals in there. I keep SH in there. Um, I usually keep it, you know, I, I like to run it out because anytime you put any type of soap, even if it's bleach stable, it breaks down and kind of gets yucky. So um, we have finished the house wash and I wanna show you guys what that looks like and uh, what your gutter line looks like and your soffits, your walls, your windows. And I have chemicals sitting on the driveway. I'm about to surface clean the driveway. So um, as you can see, uh, it is obviously drying and um, that's fine because uh, that is killing all of the uh, uh, organic matter. So we're gonna surface clean this. There's the surface cleaner. We're getting ready to do that. But I wanted to show you guys a couple of things. Um, if I walk up to this garage, this literally, it was black um, you know that weather stripping so this weather stripping was absolutely black um, and you can see all the way across it looks like brand new uh, look at your gutter line and look at your soffit it's just absolutely stunning um, and uh, so we had the uh, the homeowner um, uh, come by and uh, I did her personal property the other day and she's just she said from the road she can see it's such a difference which really made me feel good so if I turn you around you can see uh, just how beautiful uh, the gutters came out now we had to go up there and we had to do a, um, a gutter cleaning uh, because the gutters were packed and I've got some pictures um, but the gutters were just absolutely packed we got all the moldings done um, you know it just looks really outstanding uh, if I take you around here I'm trying to sell them currently on a fence uh, cleaning because uh, the fence really does need to be cleaned. Uh, we would use a metasilicate and then we would um, uh, neutralize that pH with oxalic. So we would hit that with metasilicate, let it set for about 20 minutes, um, and then we would take a, um, uh, a little stronger tip, not a high pressure tip. You can use a 40 degree tip if you want, uh, but, uh, but you have to stand off at a distance. You have to go with the grain of the board. Um, uh, we would use a, a little bit less uh, aggressive tip um, to clean and rinse that off um, and then we would uh, lay some oxalic acid on there and it would just make it look brand new but I came to show you guys really this which is just outstanding absolutely gorgeous um, look at up top you know so the so your X jet from this distance uh, easily just gets all of that clean yeah you know uh, which is which is really great I'm, I'm super grateful for that so um, I'm gonna take you around back and show you some of the areas there, especially that air conditioner. If you refer to that previous video, uh, you guys are gonna see um, what that air conditioning slab looked like. And so I'll give you a quick little before and after this. Whoops, this is some of the soffit work that we did and, and gutter work. But if I take you back here, um, check this out. That is like a brand new air conditioning slab. Is that gorgeous or what? So, uh, you know, the rest of the property, there's some compromised areas that need to be touched up and fixed, um, you know, but I uh, just kind of wanted to show you, you know, how gorgeous things look um, in regards to soffits. That's all done with the X-Jet and the poly tank. I moved that tank one time. I brought it back here to the middle of the yard and then I brought it over there. So with 100 feet each way, that's 200 feet that way, 200 feet that way, no problem at all. Uh, I was able to stretch it. Pay particular attention, guys. Look at my windows. You know, I haven't even been back here since, you know, I rinsed everything off. Look at those windows, um, you know, and that's Green Goddess, uh, which is a proprietary blend of surfactant that I blend on my own. Um, you can private message me if you would like, uh, and I would be more than happy to help you. Look how beautiful everything is, just gorgeous. Now there is dog poops all throughout this yard, so we wanna be sort of careful, but I wanted to show you how gorgeous the windows come out. I wanted just to just show you how beautiful things are. So um, now, you know, because I am who I am, um, the fence was really, really bad and I couldn't stand it. So um, I did uh, hit it and just kind of make it look a little bit better. I did not clean this fence. Um, you know, I just threw up a little bit of my house wash mix on there and, uh, and rinsed her off. And, um, and I rinsed and rinsed and rinsed. I did not clean it. Uh, this is not a finished product of a fence but uh, I did want to kind of make it look a little bit more visually appealing. So, um, you know, because the fence uh, is, is, is pretty bad throughout the property. So have a great day, everyone. Keep cleaning and I'll show you what the driveway looks like next. But I uh, just wanted to let you guys see how, how gorgeous things come out. Take care, bye-bye.